new hay feeder today. Um, for any of y'all who are familiar with hay feeders, this is a Bextra, uh, it's a Targa brand, but it's a Bextra design. Um, it's designed to, the idea behind it, and we'll, I'll, I'll show you a little bit more once we get it in place, um, but the idea is that the hay can't just go out on the ground like the traditional hay ring or hay feeder. And, um, I suppose. Um, be wasted on the ground by the design of this. So we're trying it out. We found one used or fairly new, supposedly not really used at all. I uh, got a good deal on it and we're gonna try it out with our cows, see if it's a design we like. If it is, we'll probably end up getting some more to try to cut down on that uh, hay waste. The only problem I can see right now with it is is where the other hay rings are very easily moved with a tractor. You know, you can easily uh, pick it up with a spear set it, move it wherever you need to in the field. These are quite a bit heavier, which means no lifting it by hand like we can with the other ones. But it also means um, having to do what I'm doing right now, which is uh, chain it up and move it this way. There's really no good way because of the design of it. So this will probably be the first thing that I would say I don't really like about it. We may try to pick it up with a spear at some point, but right now you can see we're moving it with chains. This is our first interaction with this new feeder. Uh, I'll show you here in a little bit. Well, right there's one. See that feeder over there, the way it's designed. It's definitely a different design. They're gonna have to stick their heads in that feeder to get it. I think they're smelling the other, somebody else's cows on it because they're getting kind of rank. Uh, yeah, so they're checking it out. As you can see, that hay bale just sits in the middle, but with that bottom like it the way it is, it can't come out. So they're gonna have to clean it all up. Good, but wasting so much hay. 